Hi, I'm Grace. Hi, Grace. Um, I'm 15 and I'm from Detroit, Michigan. So tell us about your journey. How did you get here to us? Um, my grandma is Aretha Franklin. Yep, the late Aretha Franklin's granddaughter, Grace Franklin, just auditioned for American Idol. But did she make it through? It all went down on Sunday's season 20 premiere, when the teen, who is the daughter of Aretha's son, KCAF Cunningham, opened up about her lineage with the judges right off the bat. I was really close to my grandma. I got to see her all the time. I used to travel with her a lot. I don't think I could fully grasp the fact that she was known worldwide, because to me, she was always just grandma. And when it comes to her own musical style, Grace feels like she's a totally different artist than her famous grandma. I feel like people expect me to sing like exactly like her. Oh my. But I am my own artist and I have my own voice. For her audition, the 15-year-old took on Lauren Hill's version of Killing Me Softly. Killing me softly with his song. So what did the judges think? You have to be a nervous wreck. The reason I know, you're saying with your eyes closed the whole time. It was just all a little sleepy and subdued to me. It was soft. Katy Perry asked Grace to sing another song, and that's when she busted out one of Aretha's hits, Ain't No Way. Stop trying to be someone you're not. But was it enough to convince the judges? I think you have stardust and sparkle all over you. You are beautiful. And if you'll trust us, if you'll listen to us, and you'll put in the work, I think we can find that next level with you. Yeah, Katie loved it. But Luke Bryan and Lionel Richie had their reservations. And when it came time to vote, Lionel was focused on doing what he thought was right for Grace. I think the best thing for you in life is to take a shot at going backwards. Go back and get a running start and come at this again. Give her a shot, give her a chance. I'm sure Aretha wasn't Aretha when she walked into the room, but somebody said, yes, I want to work with you. I want to develop you. You got something. I will lay down on the ground. I quit this show. I'm going to the bar. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay, so Grace didn't make it through this season, but there's always next season. And when E.T. caught up with the judges during the LA auditions in October, they shared their best advice for the contestants. What we're looking for is someone who has that instant identity. Hopefully they know who they are. Over singing is a big deal. They do the runs, they get really excited, and they feel like the more notes I hit, that's gonna prove to us that they're a better singer, and it really kind of almost goes the other way. It shows that they're lacking in some confidence on some other stuff. I personally think it's attitude. When, <laughs> when you come in and you think you know everything and you're unteachable or um, just like you, you think you've aced the test when really you don't have room to grow. If there's humility and authenticity and people always want to root for the underdog. I think that's our motto for all of our time here on American Idol is we really want to see these kids shine. 